What's up guys, JFM here, welcome back to another episode of the Let's Play, and today is episode 11. Download day was just last week, I hope you guys did enjoy. As you can tell, I did change a few things inside of the house before download day, and I gave you guys a nice little sign to welcome you. But yeah, this is the house so far. Now there are a few things that I want to get done today. But they don't really involve the house. The last episode we did, we did a lot of decorating and building. So this episode, I'd like to do some more adventuring. Like I said, I like to mix it up a little bit. So hopefully you guys will enjoy. But yeah, let's go ahead right in here. This is where we're going to find all the goodies for today. Because today, we are going to be using this gold to go to the nether reactor i'm very excited guys if you guys don't know what the nether reactor is maybe you're new to pocket edition the nether reactor is a pocket edition exclusive n version of the nether now it's not as cool as it sounds but it's still pretty neat so all you need to do is make a nether reactor core which takes three diamonds and six iron ingots and i'll put the rest of the stuff away uh so we'll put all this stuff away and we'll keep the uh, we'll keep the reactor core, and then you're going to need a few bits of cobblestone, a ton of gold, and uh, that's about it. So yeah, we'll go ahead and head into the Nether sooner or later. I have to find a cool spot, but I'm very very excited. I'm oh I'm so excited because I haven't gone in the Nether yet. Um, in 0.11.0 or the nether reactor so it'll be very exciting to see uh, if there are any new features probably not maybe there are new items that drop I'm not sure but we'll be able to at least get a few different materials that I haven't gotten on my world so far so I'm pretty excited all I need is that gold I think I need like okay there we go so 35 more gold okay so 39 okay no that's plenty right I need four okay I do have a little bit extra awesome so I did need to make four uh, gold blocks so we can put all the rest of the gold back. Now we just have to find a place to go. So let me go ahead and grab some steak uh, for safety, of course. Got to be safe. And uh, I guess now... Oh, what? what? <laughs> Get out of my house! Jeez. I don't know how all these monsters are getting in here. That's no fun at all. Okay. So now I have to find some spot to do this at, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over this way, and I'll wait for you guys, I'll just skip ahead. It's going to take a while to get there, and if you guys don't know, the nether reactor can be a little bit messy, so I want to do it as far away from the house as possible. So I'll see you guys when I get over there. Okay, I walked all the way to the coastline, so I'm pretty far away from my house, and it looks like a good spot to go ahead and do the nether, so... Let's go ahead and grab all of the supplies we'll need. So I guess, no, nah, that's about it. All we need is that gold. So let's go ahead and start building. So you need to make this specific formation if you're going to try to go to the nether. Uh, nether reactor area. I don't know what you'd call it. It's not really the nether, but it's still pretty cool. I guess spawn the nether is what the better term would be. So there we go. You just got to make this uh, kind of formation here. And then you want to put the nether reactor core in the middle. It's like the portal. You have to craft it the right way. And, and, and this one's crafted pretty weird. I don't know who came up with this design, but um, it's pretty cool. I actually like the design. So there we go. Oh, that's not where that's supposed to go. There we go. So now I think we finished. Yes, okay, we are done. So, oh, the moment of truth. This could be dangerous. Um, I'm going to try to save some of the gold, but I don't know if I'll be able to get it all. You know what I'll do is I'll do this. I'll go to split touch controls. No, I'll go off of split touch controls. And you guys will see, you can save a little bit of gold. So watch this. Oh, let's go. Come on. Oh, okay, 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 <gasps> sorry for the silence there, I was trying to, okay, I did get three pieces, okay, awesome, 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 oh, there are the zombies, there are the zombie pigmen, oh, uh, okay, I need to run, oh, look at that guy, he's on a chicken, I don't even think he can attack me, all right, let's get rid of these, oh, 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 crap, oh, oh, where are they, there's, are there a few on the chickens, oh, jeez, oh, no, he, he's killing himself, <laughs> what's going on, get out of there, there we go. I don't know what's going on there, but we found two, <laughs> two, two pigmen on chickens, and they're actually doing a ton of damage. 
What in the world? This is so weird. What's up with that? Why are they... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna leave him be. That's actually pretty funny. So the nether reactor is definitely not as hard as it used to be. Um, it's <laughs> just spawns a, a few regular, a few regular, uh, a few regular pigmen, and then a few on chickens. You gotta love it. Okay, so yeah, that was another reactor. Very exciting. Uh, it's arguable. It's arguable. Uh, but now what I can do is I can use a ton of this nether rack uh, just to use in future builds. I can break a lot of it, and it just basically spawns a ton of nether rack in your world. You don't have to be careful though because it's nighttime now. It makes it it makes it nighttime, which means you can get attacked by zombies like this. Ah, there we go. I think that's about it. Okay. So yeah, we have a ton of netherrack to, to break down, and I still have other plans for this episode. No worries, guys, I came prepared. I knew it wasn't going to take too long. The nether reactor is not too big of a deal, although um, I guess we could check the loot. What did I get out of that? What did I get out of that? Let's see. I got what looks to be a ton of cactus, 23 cactus, which is good, because I actually didn't have cactus. Um, a ton of quartz, some mushrooms, some melon seeds, some glowstone some sugar cane, some other mushrooms, and that's about it. And now I'm getting a ton of netherrack. So that's not bad at all. Now we can use uh, glowstone in some of our builds, which is pretty exciting. And we can always come back here and just respawn the nether. I'll just need a little bit more gold, and we can come back here whenever we want. So if you guys are asking for it in an episode, um, I can definitely get it done. I think it's going to be pretty cool. It's very fast. I'll probably build a rail system to get here e easier. So in the future, we can just come by whenever we want to. But for now, eh, it's pretty good. So I gotta find my way back home now, and it's gonna be pretty difficult with all these monsters around, but I gotta go. So we'll head back home, and I'll see you guys once we get there. And we're here, and I don't know how many monsters were following me, but I think I shook them all. So we're back. Awesome stuff, awesome stuff. So let's go ahead and jump into the house real quick, and maybe we can go to sleep? Probably not, though. We'll find out, can we? I don't know, no, it sounds like, oh, oh, no, 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 oh, how is he even in here, oh, come on, that was so many books, so many books, oh, oh come on, I oh, am yeah, definitely not going to get to go to sleep, jeez, man, that's a bummer, look at all this stuff he broke, do I even... Okay, well, I guess I have enough to fix this. I think that's all. And then I had... Uh, yeah, I did have... Oh, okay, so I need to also... Put that there. I think that was there, maybe? Probably not. That was not there. No, that definitely wasn't there. I don't know. I gotta figure out... My whole room is destroyed now! Oh, I know where this was. This was right there. It destroyed my, uh, it destroyed my other bush. Dang, creeper! Why you gotta be destroying my house like that? Okay, so I guess we have a little bit of renovation to do now, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, there are too many monsters in this house, too many animals. I need to figure out a way to stop them all from coming in. So, uh, okay, we have a ton of um, we have a ton of supplies though, so I can't be too upset. Do I have any uh, any leaves? I do, so I have backup leaves as well. And I guess I... Oh, I also have another book. I'm just gonna... Ugh, I, sh I have to go make more books now, I think. Because I don't think the creeper... I don't think the creeper let, uh, let all the books... Uh, let all the books stay. I think he definitely destroyed a lot of the books. Uh, so, we'll have to figure it out. But for now, let's see. Can I craft any? Is there a crafting table? Oh, I don't have a crafting table in here. Well, there's one right here. So, let's see. Two bookshelves. He really destroyed that many books? He destroyed so many books! Oh, gosh! Well, I've got some rebuilding to do, guys. I've got some rebuilding to do for sure. But that's not too bad for now. And then the sign's gone. The lovely welcoming sign's gone as well! But I guess I could put that one back there. And did I miss anything else? No, I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, and he also blew up the painting that was over here. So there we could put that one back. All right, so not too bad. And I think what I want to do now is, uh, well, I don't know. I still have a lot of stuff that I need to get back into place, but I'll do that after this episode. Um, for the rest of this episode, what I wanted to do is I guess I'll switch back to split touch now. Uh, now that I'm done going to the nether. 
For the rest of this episode, I wanted to first get some sleep, which obviously wasn't going to happen, so I have to figure out something else. But, um, I wanted to make a dog pen. Oh, and it looks like it's daytime anyway, so we're fine. We're fine. I just got my house blown up for no reason. Pretty exciting stuff. <laughs> okay, so let's put away some of these new materials that we just got. Except for... Well, no, everything. Everything, actually. We don't need anything of this. But what we do need is we need to grab some different supplies. So maybe let's we'll grab a different, few different types of wood. Why not? So we'll grab a few different types of wood. Um, and then some... Some trunks. Some logs. And we'll put away all the rest of the mushrooms and whatnot. So, okay, let's put away everything else. I think that's about it. I could just keep everything else in my inventory for now. So what I want to do now is I want to make a doghouse. And I was really excited to do this. I just didn't know exactly how, right? I didn't know exactly where, you know. I just didn't know exactly what to do. But I guess we could just try to wing it. I mean, I don't know. We could try to wing it. But first things first, I did forget. I want to chop down a few trees in the front yard because I have some future plans and we can get to working on those later. Um, but let's see. Do I have an axe? Do I have an axe in here? Oh, I forgot I'm not on split touch anymore. Or I am on split touch. Let's see. Oh, I do. Perfect. I do have an axe. Awesome stuff. So... Now that we have this axe, let's go ahead and jog over here. Do we have a few... Okay, yeah, so these trees. These trees, these three trees right here, they're pretty cool, but I do need them to go because they're in the way of something I want to do in the future, probably in next episode. So you guys will see in next episode, I have a really, really awesome idea to build. And, um, yeah, so we'll get that done. Today was more of an adventurous episode, sort of. I mean, the nether reactor didn't last too long, but, I mean, it was pretty cool. It was it was pretty cool. Got a little bit of dueling done, and we got to see some awesome zombie, uh, zombie baby pigmen type of deals. So, it was pretty cool. But, yeah, so now what we have to do is I want to figure out a way to get a doghouse to fit right here. And I think what looks to be the case is I may have to take some of this mountain out. Why are animals, are animals just attracted to, I don't know, man. There needs to be some sort of, I need to just get rid of the sound in the water, the water sound in the files of this game. I want to just go into the settings and just disable the sound of the water splashes. That's all I need. Okay, so um, I will need to grab a shovel because I don't want to be ruining all my other tools. So there we go. There's our shovel. So now we can use our shovel to get rid of some of that grass and clear up some space for this doghouse. And I want the doghouse to to go to go well. Buddy's buddy sitting in there waiting patiently for his lovely home. Uh, let's see. What can I do here? Well, I guess we'll take those down. We'll take that down. That's really all I can do, honestly, isn't it? Oh, jeez. Did not mean to do that. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Um. Okay. Perfect. So, yeah, there's not much more I can do, really. I think this is this is what I'm going to have to do. I mean, this is what I'm going to have to work with. So, let's see. Uh, if I want to use these wood. This this wood, is that is that a good idea? Yeah, I like it. I like it. I like the darker tone. So, we'll use that wood. And we can use that. So, we'll put... Uh, this will be one corner. Another corner of the doghouse. Another corner can go right here. And another corner can go right there. That's not bad at all. So, now what I can do is I can, let's see. Well, I can use these logs to go in between. Oh, jeez. I keep forgetting I'm not on uh, I'm not on the other controls. There we go. It doesn't look too bad. So, I like that so far. You know what? I actually may like it a little bit darker all around. So, you know what? I think I'll just use the spruce planks all the way. Uh, if I have any, do I do. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so we can use these. Yeah, I like it a little bit better like this. So we can use those planks, and I guess now I... Mm, yeah, let's go ahead and grab some of the stairs. I could just craft some in here really quick. And, uh, and let's see what we can do here. So, I'll need a few stairs. So, five should be in... or four should be enough, is it? Eh, we'll make another set just in case. So now we have stairs and slabs to see what we can do here. So, let's figure this out. Um, let's see. Uh, I think what I want to do is maybe put stairs like this. And then, uh, stairs like this. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's not bad at all. And then what we could do is we could put slabs like that. There, that's a nice cozy doghouse. That looks like a cozy doghouse to me. And then, 
Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I think, would it make sense to put a, like, put something over here? No, that wouldn't make any sense. No, we'll leave that, we'll leave that as it is for now. Uh, but that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good, except for, except for the part I just stuck on. <laughs> that does not look good. So yeah, that's the nice little doghouse. Now what we could do is add a little bit of variety to the front, so maybe put, I don't know, maybe give them some, um, signs here. That look, that doesn't look too bad. And then what we can also do is we can go ahead and, um, I, you know what I could do is I could craft a few things, uh, some sticks, and then I could craft a sign as well as some trap doors. I want to see what it would look like if I made some trap doors. So you can figure out exactly what to do. Also, I want to kill this spider. There are way too many monsters in this house. Get out of here. Get out of here, Mr. Sheep. I didn't ask for you. I didn't ask for you. I will keep I will keep the chickens, though. I like the chickens. The sheep? No. The sheep is not an indoor pet. Chickens? Indoor pets? That would be pretty awesome. Imagine having an indoor chicken in real life. That would be pretty cool. So, uh, let's see. What did I just craft? Oh, right. I crafted the trap doors and the signs. So, maybe that can go right there. I don't know. Just to add a little bit of flair, and then the sign can go right here, and then it can say... Oh, no. Get out of there. I need to actually type on you. Let's see. We could type Buddy's house. Buddy's house. Buddy's house. I had to say it three times because it takes me so long to type it. <laughs> okay. There we go. Buddy's house. I don't know if I like it. I'll probably change some stuff up later like I always do. But for now, I can't complain. That's not too bad. And then I think what I can probably do is... You know what we should do is we should give him a nice little carpet. Let's see what... Let's see what kind of, uh, carpet I could use, or carpet I could make. You know what, I could dye some. I think I probably have some, some stuff to dye with, right? I think I, do I have any red flowers? I don't. I would really like some red flowers. So let's see. Oh, I, you know what I could do is I could use some of these red mushrooms that I just got from the nether. Where are they? Where are they? I just saw one, but I think I'm gonna need more than one. Well, whatever. Oh, I may have them in my inventory already. Yep, I do. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time. Okay, so it's perfect. So I think we can make some dye. Oh, do mushrooms not make the dye anymore? I don't think they do. I think it's just the flowers. So looks like we're going to go on a little bit of a flower hunt. Buddy, do you want to come with me to try to sniff out some of the flowers? Sounds good to me. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's go find some of these flowers. And another spider. What is up with these spiders? Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. Looks to be good. Which way, buddy? This way, you say? Uh-oh. It's about to be nighttime. Should we sleep first? Should we? Good idea. Good idea. Also, I should probably eat as well, right? I have all this steak in here, and I'm not eating it. So I should probably do that. Let's go ahead and eat up the steak. And, um, yeah. So we'll wait till the morning to go look for some flowers. Uh, and then what we can do is we can dye the wool and get the doghouse done. I think we're, I think it's going to be pretty exciting to get this doghouse done. And then Buddy will finally have a home. He's probably jealous, right? I didn't have a home earlier. Now that I have one, I think it's time we got to get Buddy a home. But first things first, we have to find some nice red carpet. And then also, eventually, if we find some sort of blue flower... We could always, we could, uh, dye his collar as well. Oh, look, there's something right here. Okay. There's flowers right here. I don't want that creeper to see me, though. Does he see me? I don't think he does. We'll take the two flowers and run. Maybe three. Three and run. We'll run. Oh, there's another creeper over there. So many creepers. I just need to go a little bit faster than them. Let's see if I can make it back into the back entrance of the house without any trouble. I, I don't want any trouble, creepers. You guys can stay out there. I think I'm fine. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Buddy, we made it back. And it wasn't really... I thought that we were going to go on a little bit more of an exploration, but no, that was that was very fast. So now what I can do is I can make the rose red dye. Um, before there were rose flowers, uh, you did have to actually use... Um, you did actually have to actually use mushrooms to dye. But once they added um, the red flowers in Minecraft Pocket Edition, obviously they took that out, and now you use the flowers. I think it's pretty cool. If you guys remember way back in the day, we used to have those cyan flowers, that kind of like teal flowers. Those were pretty cool. But yeah, there we go. What's up, Mr. Pig? How's it going? And what's up, what's up with all these animals? Why are the animals so attracted to my house? I have no idea why, but there we go. So, buddy, you like it? It matches your collar for now, but I think we could definitely get your collar nice and nice and pretty later. But for now, 
There we go. There we go. Let's go. Come on, buddy. Just a little further. Just a little further, buddy. A little further, and you'll be inside of your very first doghouse. Come on. Get in there. Get in there. Uh-oh. I got to flip this. There we go. Perfect. Get in there, buddy. Awesome. Buddy's doghouse. How sweet is that? So now we have a doghouse for Buddy, and uh, we have a ton of empty space here for what I wanted to do in the very next episode. So today was definitely a success. We went to the nether reactor, we found a little bit of glowstone, which we can definitely use in our builds for sure. I'm very excited. Today was a pretty awesome day for the Let's Play. Hope you guys did enjoy. I think Buddy did. He looks like he really likes his new house. Hope you guys did enjoy. I'll talk to you all later. And as always, stay frosty, my friends. Peace, guys. See ya. Bye-bye.